Hello, this is Wampire here with arm wrenching technique number two. Uh, this comes from world famous Jeet Kune Do instructor Paul Vanak. Uh, I saw his instructional video. He showed this technique and I was like, man, that looks like a really practical and effective technique. So uh, Stickman is going to punch me right here with his right arm and I'm going to go just like so. This is the technique right here. So one, two. The idea here is I come in with this parry. I could hit him in the eye if I want to. I don't need to. And notice my arm comes from the bottom, not from the top, like the first technique. This one comes from the bottom. So the idea, boom, boom, boom. It has kind of a circular motion right here. This comes from the trapping techniques that is famous in Wing Chun and also Jeet Kune Do. Boom. And we are wrenching. And I remember uh, in the video he says that you're wrenching the guy's arm, but you could also slip in an uppercut if you want to. And if the guy's arm is bent instead of straight, like in the first arm wrenching video, I said the arm needs to be straight. In this one, if the arm is not straight and it's bent like so, it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna wrench his arm like so, and either way, it's good. What to take away from this arm wrenching technique number two is that when we do it, you could repeatedly wrench the arm. You could also do it in the first one, but this one I think emphasizes that aspect more. Boom, and slip in that uppercut if you can. So that's it for now. Thank you for viewing and take care, folks.